Water and Sanitation Minister Senzo Mkono says the city of Tswane should take full accountability for the deaths of 15 people in Hamans Kral. He was speaking on the sidelines of a state visit by President Cyril Ramaphosa to Lesotho. The president, alongside the Prime Minister of Lesotho, Samuel Matakane, and King Letsi III, launched the second phase of the Lesotho Water Highlands project with a sod-turning ceremony in Mokotlong. The project will see millions of cubic meters of water being pumped into South Africa. Mkunu spoke to ENCA's Mankoba Mkunu earlier. With South Africa facing water challenges, President Sul Ramaphosa is here in Lesotho on an all-important state visit to officiate the launch of the second phase of the Lesotho Highlands Water Project, which will see the construction of yet another dam, the Pudihadi Dam, which will be a 165-meter-tall concrete wall as well as a 38-kilometer tunnel that will transfer water from the Lesotho Highlands into the Gazi Dam, which we recall was part of phase one of the project and it's expected to pump over 1,200 million cubic meters of water to South Africa, Gauteng in particular. And joining me now is the Minister of Water and Sanitation. Uh, Minister, thank you very much for your time. Let's start here. Of course, the concern around uh, this project has been the delays uh, in this particular uh, second phase of the project it was meant uh, to have uh, you know, been completed by 2019 and providing water in 2020, but that was not the case. Are you concerned and are you sure that we're over these delays? Well, um, the delay uh, has been concerning to South African government and to us in water and sanitation. Hence, uh, we took drastic steps to make sure whatever issue or factor was uh, contributing to the um, delay uh, gets dealt with. And uh, that, was, that happened until May last year. And uh, we're able to talk across uh, uh, to with uh, my counterpart at that time, and uh, we resolved all the matters. There were elections in uh, Lesotho, um, a further delay, and then after elections in November, we were able to resuscitate, and then we're here today and we're happy. But looking uh, at uh, Podihadi, the work that is uh, already underway, I went there in December. I'm I'm from there now. Um, we are one with the contractors uh, because uh, they are there now almost all of them and work has started to us that is crucial but now that uh, we've officially launched this um, as a, um, a, a carried out by the, the heads of states both of them it means that we need to get to gear jump two jump three jump four get to gear number five I've got to ask you this, uh, Minister. The issue, of course, is the issue in Haman's Kral, where 15 people have yes. lost their lives. We know that the department has also intervened as far as the supply of water to that area is concerned. But in terms of accountability, Minister, surely somebody should be held accountable. Who should take responsibility for this? Now, firstly, tomorrow we are going to get results uh, according to people who are doing results. That will determine exactly, exactly what what kind of elements are there from 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 then onwards we've got to work uh, walk a very straight line on the matter uh, face people of Hamaskara and uh, once and for all deal with the problem and that's exactly what we're going to do uh, assume over responsibility and 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 correct uh, what needs to be corrected uh, I want to say for this Tswane is responsible without any hesitation and therefore we need to move over and, and beyond them. Okay. Thank you very much Minister for your time. That was Thank the you. Minister of Water and Sanitation, Senza Mkunu, just uh, speaking to us there uh, following uh, of course the launch of this project here in Lesotho but also on issues around what is happening in the country, uh, the 15 people that have died in the country saying that is quite unfortunate, but of course there are still investigations that are going on as far as that issue is concerned, uh, as far as accountability also uh, is concerned. The minister is saying that the uh, city of Tuane should take full responsibility for what has happened. Mangobam Kunu, Mukutong, Lesotho.